Welcome back, guys. This is Art and Culture Monday. Yeah, we keep um, seeing and, you know, we have to get it right. Thank you, Mr. Director Asante Sana. Welcome to KUTV Kenya. This is Art and Culture Monday. This is how we begin our week in style. And I have, it's been a minute since I opened the line. So the SMS and WhatsApp line that you are texting us through is 0739 And also, our online platforms are are open kila mahali instagram facebook um twitter you look for us we are right there at KUTV kenya and at karen blessing look for either of us and you will enjoy the most bomb show breakfast bomb show there is in the 254 and we are actually in the third hour yes we are almost there this is the third hour of the show and this is interesting. We have not had this on Art and Culture Monday. My third guest is about to give you mad, mad vibes to make sure that you are having such a fantastic time. And he is already here. So why am I speaking for him? Good morning, Titus. Good morning. How are you? I'm fine. Thank yes, you. how is your Monday morning? My Monday morning is fine. Mm -hmm. I thank God. Yes. I've been sick for two days. Mm -hmm. Homer. Yes. Uh, by the yesterday and the other day, I was not speaking. Yes. Even yesterday night. Yes. But I was praying that I wake up today morning yeah. with uh, a voice. Yes, if and you today, did. Today, I don't have uh, such a nice voice. <laughs> yes. But at least I can speak. Exactly. Speak ah, thank you. Thank yeah. you so much for coming through. Thank you for making it regardless. Guys, remember, to keep warm. August seems like hijakuja na vibes mzuri bado. So it's still a bit chilly. It's still a bit cold. So please take care. Keep it like that, all right? Keep it like that. Keep warm. Um, I want you to introduce yourself to guys at home. Titus, tell us who you are, what it is that you do, and then we get into the interview. Okay, thank you. My name's um, Titus Ompati. Yes. And I'm commonly known as, as people call me Mualim Tito. Yes. That's what they commonly call me. Uh -huh. I'm a student here at Kenyatta University. Yes. A fourth-year student. And my last semester now 4.2 yes taking bachelor of education science mm -hmm. in mathematics and chemistry yes i come from kisi county because mm -hmm. uh, i'm a catholic and we, we need to do something with catholic i introduce myself with a diocese yes so from kisi diocese uh -huh. ichuni parish yes yeah. Wow, guys, watching all the way in Kisi, I hope that you guys are, have an amazing time and that you're going to enjoy Tetas's performance because this one is right from home. So all the guys from Kisi, I hope that you guys are watching and that you're going to have a fantastic time. I feel like we should jump right in, perform one song, and we will get back, know you better, know how you're venturing into um, this type of music, and at the same time, learning about chemistry and, you know, all the science there is to do. But right about now, the first song you are performing Kenya Yetu that is what we are starting with Kenya Yetu right about now <coughs>
yes titus aha yes aha yes i like i like i like that Guys, we are talking with Titus and we were having a conversation actually on the song Kenya Yetu. And Ojuang Mariam is here. He's actually live, Mali. So look for him. Look for Ojuang Mariam. He's somewhere streaming this very show uh, live. But uh, Titus, you were telling me about Kenya Yetu and the composition around it. Yeah. Yes. So this uh, Wimbo, Kenya Yetu, mm -hmm. I composed it last year during the, the COVID uh, period. Yes. And uh, to me, COVID, COVID uh, session, that time of lockdown was somehow a positive impact to me. Yes. So that's when the time it was a lockdown. I uh -huh. couldn't travel back home. Mm -hmm. But I'm indoors. I have my computer laptop there. I have a, a, a piano keyboard. What can I do? So, and then like what up around everyone was complaining. Like yes. Kenya. Yeah. Like, does this president know how we survive? Yes. And everyone was complaining about Kenya. About yes, Kenya. and the challenges and that the we are facing, are facing and everything. Uh -huh. But uh, so it's good that it's not good to complain about this Kenya. Mm -hmm. And somewhere else, other countries, people are more suffering than yes, this Kenya. Exactly. But this Kenya, uh -huh. we have peace, we have our freedom. Mm -hmm. It's on that freedom, yeah. and it was to our own benefit. Yes. So that's when I composed that song, Kenya Yetu, mm -hmm. and uh, I recorded it with uh, a group of around six people. We mm -hmm. were not men. Yes. And we produced it at that time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ah, amazing. Um, someone is actually saying here, hi, um, hi, I'm Evans, Evans Ochichi, and I'm from Mombasa. I know that guy who is performing, he is from my village. So apparently people, thank you, Kisi people, you guys are like Mlikuwa uh, Mnangoja, and I'm you are amazing, and he is a very humble guy. That is amazing to know of you. I want to know, why did you decide to be a um, Catholic song compo uh, composer? You know, like, why that genre of music? Good. So, uh, first I was born in a, a Catholic family. Yes. And since I was young, when I was around class five, six, mm -hmm. I, when I used to go to church, there at home called the Chuni Parish Catholic yes. Church, yes. I used to sit just behind the choir. Yes. And then uh, there was this time of preaching. Mm -hmm. The priest could say, at this time, all young kids or children below 15 years, yes. you go to another hall ah, to yes. be trained on your other things. Yes. So I could hide in between the choir. I didn't <laughs> want to go out. And I was really happy mm -hmm. to see people singing. Then I got that interest of singing. Yes. Then as time goes by, at class eight yes that was 2009 when i was in class eight mm -hmm. i joined officially as a choir member yes at that uh, parish yes i started singing and i got interested mm -hmm. with a guy at that time the guy who was called patrumeo vaga mm -hmm. who used to play the piano mm -hmm. i was really interested and I, I wanted to knew it then i started at my own free time Weekdays when there's no church service, I go to church, I, I request for a piano uh -huh. and I start and actually practice. Trained. Yes. So that's so how I started practicing. Yes. Could you yeah. say you are self-trained? 
Yeah, I'm piano. self-trained. Yes. I have never gone to any class mm-hmm. of music to be taught. Yes. But here I kuangaria na kufanya. Yes. And see what other people are doing. And doing. You do Even it the theoretic part of it. Yes. Music. Ni mesoma online too. Mm-hmm. Afuata music. What yes. does it in entail to compose yes. a song to yeah. do this and this? Yeah. Wow. So this is actually um um talent plus self training and you have actually done well for yourself. I don't want us to pick a story mingi sana because we are here for entertainment. So I want us to move to Mimina as the next song. Well, thank you. Mimina songs a song done by a famous artist in Kitale in Tanzania called Bernard Mukasa and it is a wide driven used here in Kenya as one of the favorite song for Thanksgiving. Yes. So and the many people like it. Maybe I can do it a bit. Okay. I like that composition again. Um I I wanted to ask you work with quite a big team because sir you are pianist alafu there is of course vocalist there's a whole team of choir. Um you how guys how do you guys organize yourselves like for a session of practice or before you know before you get the composition right entirely. Okay. So the way we do things mm-hmm. Uh, first if we need to record a song yes the first step is to compose that song yes we can be uh, usually do it we think of a, a song uh that's to be a topic yes which song do you want to talking about what for example i did a song kenya ye to the people care si fire kushukuru mungu yes so you just go down mm-hmm. and compose I think the, the most part, uh, difficult part of it, yes. composing, you have to do it in all voices, the soprano, alto, mm. mm-hmm. ten and bass. After composing it and it's out, now you need to organize for practices. So we need to meet, uh, for example, here at KU, we yeah. usually deal with the students. So we need to find favorite time when everyone is available. Yes. So we meet. We do practice like uh, for three, four days. Yes. Uh, it is uh, not the same way we do practices at home. Yes. At home, you are dealing with uh, some 
people, my mind, the village, what, what, yes. and these are the students. Yes. So they have to do it with using little time. Ah, exactly. So like two, three, they are, four they are practices. Faster, yes, they are, and they sharper to, to get there. And then we go to studio for recording. Yes. Yeah. Ah, amazing. Uh, where can we find your music? Social media handles everywhere where can guys access this music? Yo, my music can be found on my YouTube account. Yes. My YouTube, just Taita Sombati. Yes. There you can find my uh, music in YouTube. That's yes. where you can only find it. Yes. yes. Amazing. Titus Ombati is the YouTube channel uh, handle that you are looking for to make sure that you are, are actually enjoying enjoying this music. Also, Ojuang is asking come on to imbia uni nyunyuzia maji. No, I want to, because of time. <laughs> and he will actually perform you that because I know he is very good at it right about now I want us to get to the last performance but after that guys when I come back I'm coming back with the uh, third and final lounge Emily is going to be here but we are going to take a short break before that and then we will come back and get to Emily and get that amazing amazing conversations meanwhile keep talking to me at Karen Blessing on Facebook at Karen Blessing Kila Mahali and at KUTV Kenya right about now you are enjoying Titus Ombati's music <laughs> 